Guys, the best thing about this whole thing, I got a new sticker. <laughs> guys welcome back to lowball and outdoors i wanted to jump on here real quick i've um i've ordered something i've wanted for a couple of years now finally pulled the trigger went ahead and ordered it and it should be here right about now so what did we order might you ask well do you guys remember my 6x45 that i said we were gonna be building here the next little bit well, I went and ordered an Oryx chassis system for it. MDT makes it. And we get to show it off here right now. This is uh, the very first time opening this box. Check that out right on top. Comes with a really cool chamber flag. It says MDT on it. Pretty cool. Comes with this little thank you for choosing Oryx. We hope you enjoy using this product. Super cool. Thank you card right off the bat. Oryx. Check this out. It comes with a name. On the back, it kind of gives you how to drop in your chassis system. Gives you little pictures of it. That's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to open this up. This is the first time I've not looked at it. We're going to open this up and we're going to stick in my 6x45 in it. See how she looks. All right. All right. Just like that. How sweet is that? Let's get her out of this packaging. Very nice. It comes with two brand new screws. Hold this thing in place. It has a super, super soft rubber grip. All this looks adjustable. Well, heck yeah, this thing's going to be sweet looking. Check that out. All right, let's go ahead and get this uh, set up. The only thing this thing looks like it didn't come with is an AICS mag. But that ain't no problem. Things are everywhere if we can find them. Uh, let's go get this thing set up. All right, guys. If you remember, this is my 6x45. It's open. Nothing's loaded. This is wrapped in a Boyd stock, which I absolutely love Boyd stocks. Don't get me wrong. However, I do have several of them and I kind of want to do something different with this one. So we're going to put this Oryx together. Now, something I noticed in this Oryx chassis, check that out. It comes with a rubber little O-ring. It's pretty cool. Okay, well let's get this one stripped and I'll bring you right back as I've sandwiched them together. Makes it look good because it's just little two screws. You pop two of them out, you set it in here, put two of them in, you're good to go. All right, I'll bring you right back. All right, guys, it's sandwiched together. Check this out. This is the finished product. Oh, yeah. This thing's sweet. Okay, on this build, I had to call and figure some things out because it did not come with the recoil lug. It a Savage Axis has a recoil lug made into the old stock. You have to pull that and put this one in here. That's a very important key step. Don't forget it. Then it pretty much just sets in there. You bolt it down. You're ready to go. Okay, now we got one more thing we got to do. We got to get a magazine. We got to get a magazine. For that, we call up old Larry from Midway, USA. Yo, Larry, can you send me up a AICS uh, mag? Gotcha. All right, he says it's on the way. He says it's on the way. Oh, super fast shipping. Can you believe that? All righty. Accuracy International magazine. Here we go. So, how does this thing look? Check that out. 
Sweet. Now all we got left is to install our scope, and then we will be headed to the range on the next video. Until next time, guys, let's keep it cheap.